Meet Ludwig von Beethoven. Most of you have seen him sitting on top of your grandmother's piano, looking pretty distinguished. But when you're not looking, he likes to dance. Beethoven was born in Germany, the home of pretzels, cuckoo clocks, and a bunch of other funny white wig wearing composers like Bach, Brahms, and Haydn. As a boy, Ludwig practiced very hard to please his father, who hoped that he would become the next Mozart. He didn't become the next Mozart, and his dad was disappointed. However, he did become a pretty good Beethoven, and by the time he was 30 years old, he'd composed one of the most popular piano pieces ever written. It's Fur Elise. Who's Elise? Well, nobody. It turns out the music typesetter misspelled the title of Beethoven's composition. It was supposed to be called Fur Therese. Therese was a lady that Beethoven asked to marry him. But Therese told him, No hugs and kisses for you, Ludwig. I don't want to marry you. <laughs> Therese married an Austrian nobleman instead, which made Beethoven sad. But it wasn't too long before Beethoven turned that frown upside down and went on to write more great music, like his Fifth Symphony, and his Ninth Symphony, which includes Ode to Joy. Today, we consider Ludwig van Beethoven to be one of the greatest composers of all time. 